Hey everyone, this is PowerGlub Pixels. Today I bring you a new video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to have a great thumbnail for your YouTube. It's very important to have a good uh, thumbnail if you're starting a new channel. You got to make sure you have uh, a good thumbnail so that when people see your art, um, you know, they're not just going to pass it. So what I use is Photoshop as when I'm making my designs uh, for YouTube. Uh, you know, making the video uh, is one aspect of it, but then having a thumbnail is very important because when people look at your art or, you know, your your video, uh, the first thing that they see is your thumbnail. So you have to have a thumbnail that kind of stands out. So as you can see right here, I'm drawing um, Yoshi. Uh, what I do here, I make sure that he has uh, great shadows. Um, you don't want to have shadows that are over. Okay, so for example, if I put too much shadow, it looks too black. So you got to make sure you may be around 21, the number of uh, PX on um, his character. Uh, so we press OK. Uh, and then we go to Star Fox, which is Fox McCloud. You also do the same thing as well. You give it a number 21 for its drop because you don't want to give it too much. You don't want to make it too artificial. You want to make it to the point where it looks kind of alive. So I would say a 21 gives it a pretty good um, number. And let's see. Okay, so we go to Pikachu now. The thing with Pikachu is that you got to make sure that you have a good amount of uh, yellow on this character. You notice this character has a lot of yellow. So you got to make sure that his is a little bit less. You don't want to be giving him too much. So I definitely recommend maybe uh, maybe a, a 10 just because of his yellow. You don't want to be giving too much. So let's see. Another thing you got to always remember when you're doing your, your lettering, you got to make sure that the name stands out as well. You don't want to give uh, letters that are dark. It all depends on the background. So, for example, um, it could be anything game news, right? Make sure that the colors are white and that they stand out on your thumbnail. I mean, it could be anything, but as long as it has that white theme color, it helps a lot. Um, some of these drawings that we're doing here on the left side, which is basically me and uh, my partner, Spider Empire. Uh, some of the things we got to pay attention is the coloring here. A lot of the shadows need to come alive. I'm still working on some of the colors that are, we need to bring here. Uh, as you can see, I'm trying to uh, give it a little bit more shadow into this character. You don't want to have characters that are too not real enough, I would say. Uh, let's see. So let's give it a little bit maybe a... Uh, Maybe for these characters, I would say maybe a 27. And let's see. So a lot of times when you're doing these thumbnails, you got to make sure that the characters stand out. So for example, this gaming news, it's fine. Uh, if you want to make Yoshi a little bit bigger, you got to make sure that, you know, has the perfect size. You know what I mean? Yoshi can't be that big. He has to be a perfect size, what he is as well as Fox, it's a little bit bigger. So a lot of times you gotta have good thumbnails that stand out. So for example, Pikachu, he's my third character here. Make sure that they have a great, they're not too far, now they're not too apart. Thing about designing, it takes a lot of time knowing exactly the tone of colors. Um, Power Glove Pixel as well. Uh, make sure that it also has good tone of color. So as you can see, the Power Glove Pixel uh, theme has a bit of shadow, but we want to give it a little, maybe a 35, I would say, so it doesn't blend in too much with the background. Uh, I feel that the, the name, yeah, the name, I would say it's a little too small. So when you make things, you got to make sure that it's a little bit bigger. So let's see, 100, for example, it's a little too big. Uh, let's see what we have here. So maybe a 72 can make sense. 
uh let's see 72 no it's a little too small so let me see we can go maybe 150 that can make sense yeah that's not bad i mean because if the characters are a little bit bigger obviously the name has to be bigger so the tips that you guys should know is that always have great coloring good shadows within your thumbnails and just have presence make sure that the you know it has that uh that art and um, so that's pretty much it just talking about shadows and coloring and what needs to be done to have a great thumbnail and uh, this is pretty much it for the video give me a thumbs up if you guys want more videos like this if you guys want more tips within photoshop if you guys want to uh, one on one uh, tips how to make better drawings. Uh, good guys give you a tutorial on that as well. But let me know down below in the comments what do you guys want to see. And that's pretty much it, guys. So, this is Power Pixels signing out. Till next time.